Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be testing out the new Jeffree Star Jawbreaker palette. Um, and I can't wait to try this palette. If you do like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well. Let's get straight into this video today, guys. First off, I will be priming my eyes with the, with the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer that I always use. I have a swingy chair now, so if you see me swinging around, I really don't mean to. It's just a habit now. <laughs> Thanks, Jack, for the chair. To set my base, I'll be taking the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in Sandstorm. <laughs> for foundation, I'll be taking the new Urban Decay um, Stay Naked Weightless Liquid Foundation and it's up to 24 hour wear as well. I have used this and I don't mind it. It's not like full coverage. It's it's buildable but it's really nice. I love the packaging too and it's like it's a plastic um, but it's really cute. I love the packaging. I really want to try the Pat McGrath foundation. Let me know if you guys have used it. Um, also want to really try out the Anastasia Beverly Hills foundation too. Let me know if you guys have tried any of those. Let me know in the comments because I really want to try them both. They look really nice. Norvina is um, bringing out palette I think it's actually out today on yeah I think it's actually out today um oh and it looks amazing it looks so beautiful I think I got um uh, it's really hard to match my foundation shades honestly like I think this is just that this lighting is completely throwing it off it's not that white um but I think I got like a shade a tad lighter because I know I have the powder which is darker and like the Max Shooter Fix powder which is darker so it darkens me up a little bit I think that's what I did with this foundation just for like a winter foundation just because I'm not tanned um, I just got like a lighter shade for winter which it suits my skin tone it's just it looks white as but it's really not for concealer, I'll be taking Tarte Shape Tape. I've got this as a little sample from Sephora. Um, so just set my eyes, I'll be taking the Fenty Beauty. Uh, what's it? What is it? It is the Pro Filter Instant Retouch Setting Powder and it is in the butter shade. I'm not going to powder my face just yet. I may do that after I finish doing my eyes just in case there's fallout. So I'm going to do my eyes. For eyes, I'll be taking the Jawbreaker palette by Jeffree Star. This palette is so very nice. Look at this palette. This palette is insane, honestly. The colours are amazing. The first shade I'll be taking is Bubblegum, which is this pink shade. So I'll just be putting it at the beginning of my crease. Oh my god, already, look at that. I forgot how good this palette is. I have used this palette before, um, like a couple weeks ago, and I regret not filming what I did. 
um, but I'm filming today. <laughs> I'll probably recreate the look that I did eventually. Next shade I will be taking is Gumdrop, which is this purple. Just be putting that beside it. This pink and purple shade is so beautiful. Next shade I will be taking is Brain Freeze, this blue. I'm just going to be going back and forth with these previous shades as well, just to bring them up again. This mirror is so good. And it's like such a big mirror too, which I love. Next shade I'll be using is Cute, this like teal colour. I'm just going to drag out that teal colour as well. I'm just going to go back and forth with these other shades. And then I'll do this eye off the camera and I will be right back. I am back. Um, I also did, a, did the cut crease off camera too. And I also did my eyebrows as well and powdered my face. Um, but yeah, so now what I'm going to do is like kind of create like a cut crease wing. Um, and then I'll show you what colours I'll be using as well with that too. I may do the cut crease um, like eyeliner off camera because I know it's going to take a little while. So I'll be right back. So I did that with my eyes and I just did that cut crease line. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I did it. So what I'm going to do is basically put like the colours on the opposite sides and then I'll fill that line up like that. I'll show you what I mean. So taking that cute shade, which is that teal, I'll be putting that in my inner corner. Next color I'll be using is that it's a brain freeze, that blue. Next shade I'll be going in is gumdrop. so cool I don't know if you guys can see it and if it's in focus but it, this is looking so cool and the last shade I'll be taking is bubblegum the pink What are we thinking so far? It looks really cool. I really like it. I don't know if this is in focus, but it's really cool. Really happy with it actually, but it's just taking so long. <laughs> so I'll be taking this shade. If you can see that now that's really pretty i love these pastel shapes they're so nice i'm just gonna do the rest of my face for contouring i'm gonna take as usual kkw beauty palettes and i'll be using these two shades Blush, I'll be taking California by Benefit. For highlighter, I'll be taking the MAC highlighter, and it's actually 
Beaming Blush Extra Dimension Skin Finish. It's a really nice highlighter. So for my inner corner highlighter, I will be taking Inglot. Um, it's their AMC Pure Pigment Eyeshadow. So I'll be taking this one and it's like an iridescent colour and I'll be popping that in my inner corner. For lashes, I'll be taking Model Rock um, 241S uh, Model Rock Lashes. And to coat my lashes, I'll be taking the Roller Lash by Benefit Cosmetics and I'll be putting my lashes off camera, so I'll be right back. My lashes are on. They're really pretty lashes, I like them. And for lipstick, I thought. I'd like kind of match it up with the bottom lash a bit. So I'm gonna use Jeffree Star um, Watermelon Soda. What do we think of this look guys? Pretty much finished now. I'm seriously living for this eye look. It's really cool. Something I've never tried before, but I really like it. Really took a long time to do. But yeah. That is the end of the, today's video. What do you guys think of this makeup look? Let me know in the comments below what you think. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you do, please give it a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.